Jamie here with Annapolis Discovered. We're standing in front of the Government House, the official residence of the Governor of Maryland. When this house was first completed in 1870, it reflected the Victorian style with a mansard roof. But today, it looks more like the other homes of the golden age of Annapolis, a typical 18th century Georgian country home. Join me inside as we take a look around. Here we are in the beautiful Victorian Ladies Parlor of Government House. It's in this room that our current First Lady, Yumi Hogan, was inspired to honor our former First Ladies by bringing their portraits from the stairway of the Grand Entryway right here into this room that's a little more accessible where everybody can see them and remember the many contributions that our First Ladies have made to the state of Maryland. So if you get the opportunity to come and visit Government House, this is just one of the seven public rooms that you'll get a chance to see, each room reflecting a different time period. Right off the entry hallway is the reception room. It's in this room that the federal period is reflected. Right after the American Revolution, we've elected our first governor, Thomas Johnson, whose portrait is on the wall in here. And there are some furnishings from his home, Rose Hill in Frederick, Maryland, including the clock and the mirror above the mantel. It's in this room that the governor and first lady host not only dignitaries and special guests, but the public in their annual holiday open house. There's so much more to see and do here at the Government House. I encourage you to check out information in our written blog so you can take your own tour. I'm Jamie with Annapolis Discovered. I'll see you on our next adventure.